In the last video, I showed you how to load some sounds and change their key ranges and transpose and so forth. Now I want to talk to you about effects because there are lots of possibilities. On the Mix tab, you can see that there are four different effects sends. And on the next tab over, there's the effects window. Now here are FX1 through FX4 effect slots. And then there's another set of effects on the master fader. Now let me talk about how powerful this effects section is. Each of these effects slots can have four different effects loaded into them. That's an amazing number of effects, so that you can have up to 16 different effects on four different effects sends that you can get to across the mixer window of Halion Sonic SE. So when I go to effects in this window, if I wanted to call up some different effects, like if I wanted to put a delay, on the first effect send, and then a big reverb on the second send. Now when I come back to the mixer window, I can tell each of these sounds how much of those effects I want to hear. So let's turn up some of the delay and some of the reverb, and so we can kind of hear what's going on. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take that first synth, and I'm going to turn its effects off all the way. I'm going to turn its chorus off, and its reverb off, and the phaser's already all the way off. And then on the bell sounds, I'm going to turn off its chorus and its ensemble and the hall reverb. And now I'll just be hearing the reverb that I have programmed into the effects section. So let's take a listen. So I have that delay and that reverb. Let's edit the reverb. If I hit the little E button, then I can see the control panel for the reverb underneath. Let's go ahead and load up a big effect by going to the presets window and going to the church section and the natural, let's see, cathedral warm. And if I wanted to bring some of that synthesizer in, let's go ahead and go back to the effects window and turn up some of the delay and some of the reverb on that instrument. And let me just set it up so that they both play at the same time on the velocity window. So we could load 16 different effects on four different effect sends. Now the last effects are insert effects. So you can load up to four separate insert effects at the same time. Let's load up a phaser. And let's load up the Studio EQ. And let's listen to the phaser. I'm going to hit edit here to call up the control panel for the effects of the phaser. So now we get that phasing sound. And let's go to the equalizer and turn up some of the high frequencies so that we can really hear that bell. So those are some of the effect possibilities in Halion Sonic SE, and there's one more thing I want to show you, and those are the trigger pads and how you can use those, but we'll do that in the next video.